H&W families, this is Troy McDaniel, children's pastor here at H&W. We are so excited to be able to have an in-person service together again. And I'm joined today with my friend and fellow worker, Kristen Pez. Hello, H&W preschool families. My name is Kristen Pez, and I am your preschool ministry director here at H&W. We are so excited to welcome all of you back to in-person service on September 13th. As we gradually open up our kids' ministry again, we're going to be uh, doing this in phases. So the first phase is we're going to invite all of our K through fifth grade to worship with us at 1030. And I am so excited to currently welcome all of our H&W Preschool Ministry kids back at 9 a.m. and 1030 a.m. So come on in with Pastor Troy and I and let's talk about everything that's going on here in the kids ministry at H&W. So you know that we are all in this pandemic uh, environment where we're trying to protect each other and our friends from COVID-19. So we have some safety measures in place as we enter the building. And of course, the very first one is wearing a mask. Put mine on. Kristen, thank you. She's got hers too. And we're asking everyone to wear a mask 10 and up. And then younger ages, three and nine, uh, three to nine, it's not required, but we request you to do it. And then of course, younger stage, we don't want them wearing masks at all. So while we are all in the building together, we ask that you would maintain social distance of six feet from each other. Uh, now let's go take a look at our check-in process. All of our families will be receiving an email from H&W Church with a link to a form to register, both for adult services and for the kids' ministry. After you register your family for services on Sunday morning, when you arrive here at the kids' area, you'll see that we have tables set up by Alpha. Look for your family's last name and pick up your pre-printed stickers. There'll be one to attach to your child and one to attach to yourself. We only allow one parent to drop off and pick up in our area. After you've picked up your name tag, you'll see a sign that lists the health screening questions that we ask all of our H&W families to attest and abide by. You'll then move into the area where you have your temperature scan. All children, adults, and volunteers will have their temp scanned prior to entering into the kids' area. Oh, I'm sorry, can't come. I'm just kidding. You'll see several hand sanitizing stations set up in our area and throughout our church. Please feel free to use the sanitizing station any time you would like and often. Preschool parents, you'll recognize this as one of our preschool classrooms. Come on in and see what we're doing inside to help our preschoolers stay as safe as possible. Inside our preschool classrooms, we have a reduced capacity limit that will help us to maintain social distancing within the class. All of our rooms also have their own bathroom. We'll be doing our praise and worship time as well as our Bible story here in the classroom. Parents, please know that we are doing everything possible outside and inside the classroom to keep your children and our preschool volunteers safe. However, you know your kids and we all know that two-year-olds may not want a social distance. That's okay. We'll allow them to play and be together and worship as much as possible. All right, families of kinder through fifth grade, we welcome all of you back into our rooms now. We also have social distancing we have to put in place and capacity numbers for our rooms, but we're still gonna have great ministry. We'll be utilizing great material and have an opportunity to have ministry right here in the room. The kids in each grade will stay in this room where you will drop them off and pick them up. Parents, I am so excited to introduce our preschoolers to our new preschool play area when we come back. We'll be spending our playtime on Sunday mornings out here, weather permitting. We are so excited to welcome back all of our H&W Kids friends. Friends, thanks so much for joining us on our tour for our reopening of our kids' ministry.